process of recording the second album feels a lot more satisfying. For me, the most important things, like the, the way it makes you feel, the way it can kind of open up your heart when you listen to it, and um, I don't know, it's like somebody just reaching in and twisting a tap open and, and like flood of joy and being delighted uh, to be alive. It's just such a pleasure being with such talented musicians because every time the bow hits the string or the finger hits the ivory, just something very nice happens. And, uh, you know, I've never thought of that as a given, but it, it does happen a lot with this gang. things that was in my mind initially be, before we came together as a band like when we were kind of when we were, when I was you know pondering this idea was that all the musicians had a kind of a, a, an aesthetic field that was that had you know compatibility all around and what has happened over the course of time is that that has come closer and closer and closer so that I, I could now see each piece of music as as a distinct expression of feeling you know, and I, I think this album just has more feeling in it than, 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 than the first one, you know. Uh, so it, it's kind of, um, there, there's a kind of a joyfulness in it. And in some cases, like, I think it, we feel, a, it feels like almost a little euphoric here and there, you know. Uh, maybe that's an overstatement of the, of the experience of it, but, but uh, it, it's certainly joy. And I think there, there's a lot of childlike simplicities in it, you know, I think learning to to play very simply and, and to not be afraid to play in an innocent and kind of vulnerable way, you know, in other words, like not playing as if though there was a point to be proven about how one plays, you know. The main thing is to make it sound natural, and um, I think we've we've done that with this album. I'm I'm happy with it in that we didn't overwork it and didn't play the tunes over you know a thousand times to try and get what we wanted. My role has been partly that in in kind of in meeting Irla Quivin, Dennis and Martin, I'm listening from very much outside the tradition. I think it can sometimes be hard for for any of them to hear what it is that they do that is extraordinary, that that reaches beyond the bounds of that, and that really will just like touch anybody. And so I think that's um, I think that's been my role in this band is to honestly to have very little regard for the tradition and to just be listening to like okay simply as an artist, simply as um, simply as someone who is trying to move other people. What is it that you can do that no one else can do? Mm -hmm. 